What's up guys? So today's video is going to be a dorm room tour. Why is my shirt acting up? I don't know. It's looking kind of weird. But um, yeah, why is my shirt doing that? Anyway, today's video is going to be a dorm room tour. And before I get started with the video, I want to say a couple of things. The first thing is that the way you're seeing my room in the room tour, that's not how my room came. My dad actually rearranged the room. Like, so shout out to him for rearranging it because the way it was set up at first, it made the room super tiny and the way my dad rearranged it made the room spacious. My school has room inequality. So like, like I said, the way my room was set up was at first made the room look small but the way we moved it made it look big some rooms on my floor you couldn't even re like rearrange the furniture to make the room look big like some of the rooms on the floor were really small and then others were like really big so it's kind of weird but i'm happy and blessed i got one of the bigger rooms i hope you guys enjoyed this dorm room tour let me know what you guys think about it let me know if you want one for next semester also in the video you might see that my door was decorated um, it didn't come like that, obviously. This girl decorated it for my birthday. Um, so yeah, shout out to her. She's super nice. It said happy birthday. Thumbs up this video if you enjoy it. And let's get straight into the video. So this is the door we just walked from. So from the door, it's a really long door. I really like this door actually. You know, probably like it's just a door, but some of the other dorms have weird doors. Um, then we have a light switch, which is right, which is right here, just off and on. The lighting in our room is not that good. And then we have a little fire thing. And up here, I put two command hooks. So this one's mine, and that's my roommate's. So on mine, I just have my. Um, let me make sure it's not showing anything. I just have my like Wallen student ID and she just has her jacket up. Moving on from the door to the other side, which is the left side, my left. We have a mirror and it looks like this. The mirror's pretty good, but like I said, the lighting's bad, so it makes it hard to do makeup. So after the mirror, you see the fridge area. And this is what it looks like. It's right next to my desk. So we have a little thing that says, um, I don't know, stop sexual assault and green terp. So yeah, so this is my fridge on top of it. These are things that don't belong to my roommate and I. Let me turn on this lamp. Okay. So this is my friend's peanuts. That's another friend's water bottle, another friend's cup, and another friend's hair product. And this stuff, I don't know who it belongs to. So we just keep that there. In the fridge, we don't have much in here besides coffee creamer, a water bottle, and some strawberry lemonade. I'm moving from the fridge, we have the desk area. I don't know why it's kind of dark, but here I have my uh, mirror, and it's like double-sided, so it's like the magnified side, and like the less magnified or whatever. But it's kind of dirty because I let someone use it to do their hair, and like their hair products are over there, all over on it, so I have to clean it off. And then here I have this thing which I made and like some arts and craft thing at my school then I have a camera case over there then I have my phone right here my iPad and my laptop and I got this lamp which has two outlet things so my computer thing is plugged in and then inside that pouch I have some earrings and then I have some business cards so on top I have some hand sanitizer I have two books for English the bracelet belongs to my friend, and so does that lipstick. And then I have some painkillers and that Chipotle tissue. Moving on, I have a whole bunch of notebooks for taking notes. Then I have my criminal justice notebook and then my communications textbook. Or my criminal justice textbook and my communications textbook. And then I have my printer and my calendar on top of that. Then 
on top of the printer, I have like just different posters I got from different events. And then my friend made me this for my birthday. It's like that. So yeah, I have this. And on top of that, this Maryland Pride poster. And we got this, I believe, like move-in week and stuff. And like the class of 2020 made up that M and the number 20, the numbers 2020 at the bottom. And then I have this light thing going around here because it was hanging up, but then it fell down and I didn't feel like putting it up because we're about to leave. So I'll show you what I have inside my desk. This is just like the chair we have. It's kind of like a rocking chair. Um, I don't have much in here anymore, but I used to have a lot. So I have some phone cases on this side and I have a folder, a brush, a selfie stick that I got from my friend's prom, some napkins, and then I have this ticket. I went to go see this play at Arena at Arena Stadium or Arena someplace in DC. This was a really good play. It's called Smart People. And then my computer case. I have some pencils, stapler, scissors, like basic stuff like that. And then underneath my desk I have my backpack and a trash can. So from moving from my desk we have my bed. So I took off the comforters that was on my bed because it was just gonna hot in here. So if you guys want to see what comforter I had, I will link it down below. Like the video down below because I showed it in my summer a summer vlog. So this is my co covers that I'm using now. It's just a really soft blanket from JCPenney. And then I have a boyfriend pillow. And then these are my sheets. They're just like this white and like triangle dot pattern. Um and so I have the same pillow that matches the sheets. I have two soft pillows from Marshalls, one here and then one behind the pillow that matches the bed, the bed sheets. And I have a plain white one in the back. On the wall, I have this poster or canvas that says love is everything. And above that, there are like tapes all around there, tape pieces all around there because my lights were on there at first. So moving on from my bed, we have my TV. So, there's a lot of handprints because of my friends. And then the TV remote is right here. So, the TV is on top of the dressers. And I really like the dressers in this, this dorm because the dorm I'm living in doesn't have long dresses like this. It has like three short ones. But these drawers are really big and deep. So, here I keep like my underwear and um, bras and stuff like that. Here I keep my t shirts. Yeah, not my t-shirts, like my shirts, like the shirts I wear to classes and stuff. And then the third one, I have dresses and like stuff like that. The fourth one, I have jeans. And then the fifth one, I have um, pajamas. I opened my pajama dresser so you guys can see like how deep it is. Obviously, I have a lot of PJs in here. They were once folded, but it's now the end of semester. So, yeah, things happen. Besides my dresser, there's my roommate's dresser, her bed and her desk and then we make it to the closet before i get into the closets i have some balloons up here which i got from a networking event so yeah this is what our outside of our closet looks like if we have a little towel rack out front so i'm gonna go inside the closet it's a really big closet this is bigger than the closet i'm gonna have next semester i can't wait to show you guys what my dorm next semester is gonna look like because i'm getting my own bathroom i'm gonna share with three other girls so my closet, I just have some jackets and scarves and blazers and sweaters hanging up. On the bottom, I have my Sperry's, my sandals, and my shower shoes. Then next to that, I have, can't really see that, but I have these, um, these three bins. And the first one has hair supplies. The second one is pretty much empty, and the third one is completely empty. Then to the side of that, I have, so hard to show you guys, I have a bag full of other bags, and then I have a stool and a broom and a dustpan and then my laundry bag is over there so I have some wet wipes a water bottle body wash an iron toaster some snacks some halos coffee cups water and then it's so hard to show you guys then all the way above I have my shower cap with my toothbrush and um shower cap I keep my sponge and stuff somewhere else which I'm not sure if I showed you in this video it's in my room but I didn't know if I pointed out and then up there I have some halos some more halos so as you guys can see, like this closet is very, um, did I say I have a toaster? I don't have a toaster. I have a toaster box. I can't remember if it said that or not. 
they're in the toaster box are like paper plates and stuff like that so this is what the closet looks like it's a big closet like it's huge and like there's more room back there and then I'm gonna close the closet so then after the closet we make it back to the door so once again from the door this is what you're gonna see the fridge my side the dresses in the middle my roommate's side and then the closets my balloons and the light is up there oh and I forgot to point out that poster for that poster up there that says hear my story and yeah this is what our room looks like so thank you guys so much for watching my dorm room tour i hope you guys liked it if you liked it give me a big thumbs up don't forget to leave a comment down below and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys